You ready? All right, so let me write this bigger. So y minus y2, y1 minus y2 times x over 5 equals b. All right, so what are we solving for? What are we solving for? y2. All right. So in order to get y2 by itself, you're going to have to eventually distribute this x. You with me? But first, it's just nice to clear the fraction. So what would you do, what would you do to clear the fraction? Hmm? So multiply over here, and then what about the other, what about the other side? All right. So wipe out there, and distribute on the top. What do you get on top? Get uh, equals five b. All right, and we're trying to get this y2 by itself. So what are we going to move over? Um, you need to get like, well, it's kind of like this. Like if you get 5 minus x equals 7, and you want to get x by itself, what would you do? Well, you could, but it's easier just to move the 5 over. So let's get rid of the x, y to the 1. So let's get rid of this right here. So how do you do that? Mm -hmm. minus x y one minus x y one that's gone now what do we get equals x y one all right cool okay uh what do you think the next step is we're trying to get this y square by itself or y two i mean good so divide by negative x divide by negative x. All right, then you're going to get y2. But you're not supposed to have a negative in the denominator. So what you could do, do you know how to deal with that? All right, what you can do is wrap the entire numerator with parentheses. Bring that negative that's down below, that's right there. Bring it up instead. Bring it up. All right, so then write your old num your old numerator in the parentheses, 5e minus x, y1. And now what can you write down below? Since what we did was we just basically moved this, almost. We moved this negative right here, and we, we moved it right there. Oh, no, there's an x down below. You see this? So th there was a negative here. And I move the negative back to the, I move the negative to the top, but you have to put you can't just attach it to the the five. You have to attach it to the whole thing, so you have to put parentheses around. What's that? Yeah, you got to distribute the invisible one now. You got to go like that. All right, so what's the final answer? Okay, I know you have to go. Hold on a sec. 